Hi friends, I am Roxana Murtaza. You are watching me on my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to tell you about the East China University of Science and Technology Shanghai Government Scholarship. It has two uh, two scholarship. You know, one is the CSC scholarship and another is the Shanghai Government Scholarship. This university undercomes the list of the Shanghai Government Scholarship. So those students who are going to apply for this university have very um, have the beneficial of this um, as compared to the other student who are applying for CSC scholarship because CSC scholarship and Shanghai scholarship you know both have the same uh, facilities both have the same stipend and uh, it doesn't have any anything uh, difference between both of these scholarship and uh, if you are applying for Shanghai government scholarship as well as the Chinese government scholarship for this university it has uh, increased your chances of admission so you are in a little bit uh, safer side as compared to the those people who are apply for just only CSC scholarship and uh, what you need to do is that you I will show you what are the requirements for Shanghai government scholarship you know here you can uh, see the admission guideline for this scholarship and the qualification you know Chinese start program and English start program both are available and the uh, application deadline is for 10 april 2022 for scholarship you know for those people who are going to apply for uh, scholarship and who are going for application of sub sponsor you have enough time you can see here 20 june 2022 and for masters and doctor program you can see here and um, both programs are offered and uh, the duration you can see three to um, you know master student three two point five three three years and uh, you can call um, for um, phd three to four years and uh, that's how you can uh, when that's how it works uh, the PhD programs and master's program in China and language requirements you can see here the application checklist you know what are the documents that you need to have you know passport copy photocopy and um, here you can see copy of uh, graduation and the degrees you have a transcript you have proof of english uh, proficient certificate or chinese proficient certificate you have acceptance letter if you have then you can upload two recommendation letter from professor or associate professor here they have clearly mentioned that they want you to have recommendation letter from professor or associate professor they are not going to be accept assistant professor um, professor um, recommendation and uh, here they have even mentioned that the recommendation letter should be issued from 1st September 2022 so it not be older than this you know if you have received this before the this deadline then you need to be ask your teachers to give you um, to, to renew it for you and um, Study plan is also required and the other supporting documents are required. Non-criminal certificate is required and a statement of financial support is also required and a copy of foreign physical examination. These are things that you need to have and uh, you can see here the forms you can uh, you can download it from here and uh, non-criminal uh, documents and uh, st uh, you know st statement of financial support and a physical examination record for foreigners you can see here only accept Chinese or English if uh, you know only accepted Chinese or English documents if not no trans copy of Chinese and English translate shall be uh, provided so these are the things and um, scholarship programs you know Chinese government scholarship is also a category B type of program and here we will going to talk about the Shanghai government scholarship Shanghai government scholarship is a very good scholarship and uh, here you can see uh, you can click here to um, know about this scholarship and uh, here they have also presidential scholarship only for PhD students and um, and yeah this is also good uh, good opportunity for you to get a uh, Shanghai government scholarship and uh, application procedure uh, some you can visit this link link is given here you need to register yourself on a university portal uh, university portal is in this uh, you, if you will click this link you will it will lead you the university portal and uh, there you can uh, select whether you are going to apply for university CSC or the university scholarship I mean to say there's Shanghai or you need to apply for CSC scholarship and it, it has admission it has application fee you can see 600 RMBs 
so you can apply you can you can you you have to submit this amount of uh, application fee you know this is university has application fee um for shingai not csc scholarship that's how you can um that's how you can you know even they have mentioned at the at the uh, bottom of this page that you need to um, this is the way to just online payment and um, and uh, he can you can see he through wechat our bank account is and everything is given here and uh, i will see you i will see you in next video till there allah peace